Thanks for joining us here this Sunday evening at 6 o'clock. I'm Matt McCutcheon in tonight for Jenny. Our meteorologist Lindsay Monroe is here tracking the conditions right now to see if we can get any relief inside. I think all of us would love you to say it's going to drop about <laughs> 20 degrees overnight, but right. maybe not. It sounds maybe like. if you're only inside in the air conditioning. <laughs> yes. We are in the midst of a heat wave, and unfortunately, Absolutely. if you're not a fan of the heat, it's going to linger into Tuesday. So oh. just saddling up for the next several days where the highs return to the 90s. With all of this moisture in the air, we have been tracking a few of these little pop-up showers on my Doppler 13 radar. Nothing that's indicating lightning, which is a good thing. Could put a very, very brief damper on any outdoor plans over the next few hours. Noblesville, this is just south of uh, the Noblesville intersection there with Fishers. You can see just a little bit of moderate rainfall where we have some of those darker colors on the radar. That orange and red that shows up could be a brief, a moderate to heavy rainfall. Getting ready to move into Alexandria just south of Elwood. This is going to take us closer to Delaware County, just to the north of Anderson. Again, this is not widespread rain. Most of us stay completely dry for this evening, but all of us dealing with the heat. We are still at 90 at Indianapolis after a high today that approached 93 degrees. It's currently 93 in Muncie, 91 in Columbus, Greensburg 92. And off the top of the show, the heat index still in the triple digits across a good portion of central Indiana. Heading out for this evening, maybe firing up the grill over the next few hours. Be prepared for it to stay warm. We stayed near that 90 degree mark through 8 o'clock this evening. The sun sets during the 9 o'clock hour as we fall back through the 80s. We wake up tomorrow morning with temps in the mid-70s with again that heat wave continuing. We'll talk about when we finally break this heat when that cooler air arrives plus some rain chances in our near future. More widespread rain. The timeline on that coming up in the full forecast. Matt. Toasty times. Lindsay, thank you.